Well, new information tonight after police say a gunman shot and killed four people, including a nine-year-old boy at a business complex near Anaheim, California. Authorities say officers shot the 44-year-old suspect before taking him into custody. News Nation's Chip Yost joins us live from the city of Orange. And Chip, what did we learn today about this deadly shooting? Well, from what police have told us so far, it does not look like this mass shooting was a spur of the moment thing. It looks like this was planned out. For one, police say when they got inside and started investigating, they not only found the gun, they found a backpack that had more ammo in it, had pepper spray in it, even had handcuffs in it. And they also say the suspect took some steps not only to lock his victims inside so they couldn't escape, but also to slow the police down in case, case they showed up. Police say when they arrived at the scene of a mass shooting inside this business complex Wednesday, the shooting was still going on, but they couldn't get inside. Officers immediately approached the building, however, were unable to enter the courtyard due to the fact the gates had been locked from the inside. It appears the suspect used a bicycle type cable lock to secure the gates from the inside on both the north and the south sides of the courtyard. Two officers engaged the sus suspect from outside of the gates and an officer involved shooting occurred. Officers then forced their way into the complex and took the injured suspect into custody. Additionally, officers located two victims in the courtyard area, one of which was a nine-year-old boy who was deceased. An adult female who had also been shot was found with the boy. It appears that a little boy died in his mother's arms as she was trying to save him during this horrific massacre. A search of the complex found two women and another man also dead. The offices involved were part of Unified Homes, which is in the mobile homes business. The suspect, who was taken to the hospital in critical but stable condition, was identified as 44-year-old Aminadab Gonzalez, whose last known address was in Fullerton. The preliminary motive is believed to be related to a business and personal relationship which existed between the suspect and all of the victims. Now, that woman who was found wounded near that nine-year-old boy was also taken to the hospital in critical but stable condition. The names of the four people killed in this incident still have not been released. Reporting live in Orange, I'm Chip Yost, News Nation.